Again, the focus. Hello. So uh, I've been messing up with uh, Arduinos and OLED displays. This is the Arduino on a, a piece of uh, perforated board. Uh, is an OLED display, organic uh, light emitting diode display. We've got an SI5351 clock generator just by here. Rotary encoder. We've got a present Jackson. It's the five band version. I've got two of these. Um, one of them is uh, um, downstairs. That's got a frequency counter built in, well, built onto it and a few other bits and bobs. This is my sort of like bench top uh, one. Uh, just for messing about with, really. So, as you can see, if you're clued up at all on radios, you can see that the PLL is missing and the VCO is missing. Um, here's the VCO. Um, I put the PLL uh, away because I don't want to get it damaged uh, by static or anything. So, um, as is, the radio wouldn't work without a PLL or a... Um, or the VCO. So we've got it rigged up to the little uh, Rama frequency counter with a homemade uh, dummy load at the back. And um, what you can see here in the OLED is uh, a frequency 20, 24505. And uh, if I key up, let me see 27, uh, 24. Keep saying 27, so I'm supposed to say 27. Uh, 20, 24, 505. So if I turn the rotary encoder, you can see it um, goes on up through. Step sizes can be altered to anything you want. I'm just doing this so that it goes up uh, quite quickly. So we're coming up to 27 megahertz now. Power on the radio has gone up a little bit as well. Well, it's gone up a fair bit, but I've got the I've got the radio power turned down because I don't want it to overheat my dummy load the length time I keyed up. So we're making our way up through 10 meters now. And it's still uh, it's still delivering a, f a reasonable amount of output, even though the power is turned down. So we just reached 30 megahertz. Just leaving 30 megahertz now. So that's about this range, but the but power has dropped right down. It's um it's solo now that the counter isn't picking it up enough of a signal to be stable. So if I come back down a little bit. So I've worked out that um, usable, it's from about 30.5 megahertz, which is basically there on down through to 24.5. There's still some work to do. As I said, I got some leakage from the um, carrier generated into the receiver. So there's still some uh, some work to do, but it looks promising. It does look promising. It's a good old range, more than uh, more than I'd need. As you see, it's gone out of. Uh, it's still it's still keying up, but there's not enough power from the radio now to. Get the counter to um, to behave properly. That's a twenty three point eight megs. Come back up to so it, it, there's enough power at twenty three point eight nine to roughly or oh, twenty three point nine oh five. It is sorry to get the counter to behave, but it's not uh, it's not showing properly. So twenty four it is. A little bit of tweaking on the radio. And you could probably get it to cover 24 to 30 with a reasonable amount of power. I dare say receive is going to be similar. But um, 24.5 up to 30.5 seems uh, realistic. So I'll go on up through now to... Uh, 
um, 27.505. So you can alter him uh, in any step you want, really. And go up quite quickly. Obviously, this Rama count is only a five digit, so. As you can see, it's following it, though. And we're coming down now to 10 meters. Down to CB. Down to the CB band. Of course, all alphas and everything like that are all filled in because uh, it just it doesn't do any jumps or anything. It uh, is straight through, which is quite nice. So, five nine five, which would be an alpha normally, is there. So is five forty five, four nine five, four forty five. It's all there, and then you're down through to the mid band. You just keep on going. So it's uh, it's quite nice. So we can go up in um, hundreds or kilohertz. Megahertz. Very fine steps, these are. A bit too fine, really. I think 100 hertz is, uh, is just about uh, small enough, really. So we're in kilohertz at the moment. So we're going up in uh, one kilohertz steps. So there we are. So uh, it's still a work in progress, but uh, it looks promising. Thanks for watching.